Well, it is official. The Washington football team has signed Brian Fitzpatrick to a one-year deal worth $10 million. Hi everybody, welcome to this channel. This channel is dedicated to the Washington football team, formerly known as the Washington Redskins. So if you're new here, you're gonna to want to subscribe. So the Washington football team has found their starting quarterback for the 2021 season and Ryan Fitzpatrick. Fitzpatrick will be 39 years old coming up in this season. So we all pretty much feel that he is going to be that one year stop gap until that we can find our quarterback of the future. In my opinion, I think we are going to find that quarterback in this year's draft. I really feel like that signing Ryan Fitzpatrick almost kind of you know shows the hand of the Washington football team. I feel like now there's going to be a lot of emphasis put on the draft. Now, do I think it's going to be either Trey Lance or Mac Jones? Don't know. Don't know. Um, I would not be upset over either one of those quarterbacks, although I feel like maybe Trey Lance would probably be somebody that you would definitely sit for the first year, which could actually work out in our favor because, you know, I certainly have a lot of confidence in Ryan Fitzpatrick. He's going to win you some football games. Um, and I really believe that we're going to be okay with Ryan Fitzpatrick going into the 2021 season. Now, uh, a lot of people has called him Mr. 50-50. So, you know, it's kind of, you get the good Ryan Fitzpatrick, you get the bad Ryan Fitzpatrick. But overall, we still have Taylor Heineke and we have Kyle Allen. Now, you may ask, well, if we have all three of those quarterbacks, why would we be going out and drafting yet another quarterback? And plus, let's not forget about Steven Montez. We have him as well, right? Well, that does not necessarily mean that all of those quarterbacks are going to be able to make it on the team. I know we signed them, signed them to contracts, but that does not necessarily mean that they are all going to actually be able to make it on the team. Having said all that, I still feel like regardless, we are definitely going to draft the quarterback. Now, probably, well, I don't know. I'm not going to say probably. It may not be in the first round. may not be in the second round. We may not find a quarterback until the third round. Who knows, maybe later than that. But I do feel like that this is tipping our hands saying we are going to look to the draft to try to draft our next franchise quarterback. And then we're going to have him sit behind Ryan Fitzpatrick and either Cal Allen or Taylor Heineke, more than likely probably Taylor Heineke. And then we're going to go from there and see if that he can develop into the quarterback that we need him to be in the 2022 season. I feel like that's what's going to happen. And let's see how well that this video ages in a few weeks or especially after the draft because this video may get laughed at after that. But I really feel like that is what's going to happen. I really feel like that we are going to look to the draft this year for a quarterback. We got our bridge quarterback set. Things are falling into place. Now let's see if we're going to go out and get some wide receivers now. So with that being said, hope you enjoyed this video. Give me a like and leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about the Ryan Fitzpatrick signing. And as always, if you're enjoying this channel, please consider subscribing to this channel. And when you do, please also hit that notification bell so you will always be notified when I come out with a brand new video. That being said, welcome Ryan Fitzmagic. Let's get some magic rolling and hell to the Washington football team.